Vacation in Hawaii, Cruise 2023, Travel Guide, Discover All That Is Beautiful Only Here. Why go to Hawaii, the Big Island? Geographically distinct, the island of Hawaii, or the Big Island, as it is more often known, is home to a variety of landscapes, from humid and lush rainforests to deserts made of hardened lava, snow-capped peaks, and black sand beaches. And it keeps expanding. The active, fire-breathing Kilauea volcano, Hawaii's trump card, has been adding land to the island since 1983. Volcanic activity resulted in eruptions, earthquakes, and the collapse of the Hale Momau crater during the most recent eruption in May 2018. It is true that if you came here expecting a normal Hawaiian vacation filled with luaus and a honeymoon-like ambience, you most likely fell short. But these state parks and hiking trails offer sites that no other Hawaiian island can match. You probably haven't ever seen colors like those on the beaches. If you just have a short amount of time to visit the island, join one of the top Hawaii tours to benefit from the insider knowledge of a knowledgeable native. Best Things to Do in Hawaii, The Big Island the largest of the eight Hawaiian islands is called Hawaii, sometimes referred to as the Big Island. No matter whatever part of the island you visit, you'll never have a hard time discovering a one-of-a-kind Hawaii adventure that will leave you with unforgettable memories. Black Sand Beaches, White Sand at Anehoamala Bay, also known as A Bay, and the Four Mile Onomea, Papikio, Scenic Drive, the most well-known scenic route on the island of Hawaii, can all be found along the Kohala coast. Onomea Bay is also reachable via hiking. You can stop at a lookout to take in the beautiful Eden-like Palolo Valley or travel to Hilo for the Hilo Farmer's Market to browse a variety of Hawaiian delicacies, produce, and crafts along the Hamakua Coast. The photogenic 442-foot Akaka Falls is also nearby. Wearing reef-safe sunscreen, of course, you can swim with manta rays or sea turtles along the Kona coast, or you can go on a small group whale-watching tour to see enormous humpback whales in their natural habitat. Consider joining one of the top Hawaii tours if you'd want some assistance discovering all of the island's breathtaking natural attractions. 1. Hawaii Volcanoes National Park Mauna Loa and Kilauea are the two active volcanoes in Hawaii Volcanoes National Park, although Kilauea is the one that visitors absolutely must see. Kilauea, a 4,000-foot-tall mountain, has been erupting since January 3, 1983. More than 700 homes were destroyed in 2018 when it burst into the Puna District residential neighborhood. It has erupted as recently as January 5, 2023, however as of March 7, 2023, the eruption ceased. For the most recent information on trails, safety warnings, and whether or not there is an active lava flow, check in at the Kilauea Visitor Center. Center. Many tourists to Hawaii put Kilauea at the top of their list, with some saying that it was impressive whether or not lava was flowing. Numerous people opt to spend several days hiking in the park while traveling on the picturesque chain of Craters Road, where a paved road was naturally dead-ended by a 2003 lava flow. If you just have one day, though, go for the 11-mile drive or the three-hour climb along Crater Rim Drive. As you go through the spectacular rainforest and past the Kilauea Crater, you may take in the park's distinctive flora. To learn more about the park and Hawaiian history, past visitors advise you to join a ranger-led walk if your schedule permits. When you arrive, check inside the visitor center to see if any ranger-led events match with your visit. This is where many of the top Hawaii tours make stops. Tuakaka Falls State Park. 
Northeastern Hawaii's Akaka Falls State Park is accessible through a quick, 0.4-mile, easy hike. The reward is two waterfalls that follow one other, the impressive Akaka Falls, which gave the park its name, and the flowing Kahuna Falls. The park is located 15 miles north of Hilo off of Highway 220 at the end of the Akaka Falls Road. Daily hours are 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. $5 each person is spent on entrance fees and parking costs another $10. On-site amenities include drinking fountains and restrooms. You should enter the trail on the left, south, side if Kahuna is not your main concern and you merely want to see the lovely Akaka Falls. 3. Hawaii Tropical Bioreserve and Garden This beautiful, tropical garden on the island's east side has more than 2,500 species of rare and endangered plants. Hikers can explore the trail's waterfalls, bridge crossings, and Onomea Bay views. Additionally, there are places to, st to stop and have a picnic while admiring the scenery. It is advised that you wear comfortable shoes, sunscreen, and insect repellent. The Hawaii Tropical Bioreserve and Garden is open daily from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. The final admittance is at 4 p.m. It is situated about 7 miles north of Hilo. Youngsters aged 5 and under are admitted free of charge, while tickets for adults are $25 and for youngsters aged 6 to 16 are $12. There are amenities like a visitor center with a gift store and facilities as well as free parking. For Explore Kailua Kona On the west side of Hawaii, Kailua Kona is a well-liked vacation spot with a lengthy stretch of Ali'i Drive lined with hotels, restaurants, and stores. The real town is Kailua, although Kona is the larger district. However, there is also a Kailua on Oahu, therefore, the town on Hawaii is known as Kailua Kona to distinguish between the two. However, the majority of residents simply refer to it as Kona, which also includes the neighborhood. There are many locations to snorkel along the local coastline, including Kamakahonu Beach, also known as King Cam Beach. The world-famous Kona coffee farms can be found if you travel farther north. The humid climate of South Kona is perfect for cultivating coffee. This area is also home to a number of historical landmarks, such as Puohanua Ohonomanau National Historical Park, often known as the Place of Refuge. Best Times to Visit Hawaii, the Big Island The finest months to travel to Hawaii's Big Island are September through November. The island's typically affordable lodging rates significantly increase during that time. Since the year-round temperatures are consistently in the high 70s or low 80s, you might want to avoid the most expensive period, which runs from December to March, unless you enjoy surfing. Regardless of when you intend to travel, take some time to evaluate a few travel insurance packages, like COVID-19 travel insurance, essential in case you or a traveling companion becomes ill, and travel medical insurance, perfect if you intend to hike through Volcanoes National Park. Getting around Hawaii, the Big Island Driving is the most convenient way to explore Hawaii's Big Island. Simply put, the island is too big to navigate without one in an affordable and practical manner. At either the Kona International Airport, KOA, or the Hilo International Airport, ITO, you can pick up a rental car. Alternatively, if you want to spend a lot of money, you can take a taxi from the terminal to your hotel. Once you're close to your lodging, you might be able to use the island bus system to get around town but keep in mind that its schedule isn't always practical for tourists. Most visitors to the Big Island connect through Honolulu International Airport, HNL, on Oahu, from where you'll fly into Hilo Airport on the island's eastern side. If you're staying on the Kona or Kohala coast, the Kona Airport on the west side will probably be more handy.